We have run out of fuel, though. That could be a problem. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Panzer here, and welcome to Simple Planes. This is a... well, if you've ever played Kerbal Space Program before, this is like the space plane part of that game, but with slightly different flying physics. So, well, the controls are very, very similar, and you get to build custom planes. So this is one of the pre-built planes that comes with the game, and this has twin props facing backwards, and we can spin that up there. We start to move forward, and let's take off. Let's see how long it actually takes for this plane to take off. I don't actually know how long it's going to take us to get off the ground, but uh, hopefully it doesn't take too long. Oh, there we go. We're a little bit in the air now. Let's pitch it up a little bit. And gear goes in. And off we go. So, flying in this game is fairly simple. And, uh... Can sort of just fly around kind of aimlessly, really. There's a lot we can really do. And, of course, landing in uh, just about any game that involves flight is always going to be just that little bit tricky. So we're going to come around back to the runway here, and let's try to bring this plane back onto the ground. Let's lower our speed a little bit. Now this is not normally how I would bring a plane in, but you know what? At the moment, I think it will be fine. Well, you know, any landing you can walk away from. Alright, so we're going to have a hand at building our own plane now, and there's going to be a slight twist to this. So, what we're going to do is we're going to build not just a... a f well, it's going to be an aircraft, but it's going to be a helicopter. Yes. What we're going to do is immediately jump into building a plane that doesn't want to be a plane. Alright, so let's build the basic structure of this. I think we need... I don't think we need one of those. What we need is... Angled corner. I just want to make a nice looking nose. Yeah, that, that seems to work. I'm okay with that. And... Build a little corner on it. And another one there. Just kind of making a nice little shape here. Alright, so we're gonna, I'm going to cut to where I've gotten the basic shape of it more or less done, and then we'll go from there. Alright, so that's the basic shape of it done, pretty much. Um, I just really need to make sure that this works. I have no idea if this is even going to work. It looks like a helicopter. I mean, it looks good enough. Oh, whoops. Um, but I don't know if this is going to work at all. So I'm going to put some landing gear on here. Uh, I think we definitely need that. So we've got a rear landing gear. I think we can do that. Uh, that should be turnable. But it's not going to let me do it. It's fine. And we need... Uh, wing landing gear? No, 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 no. We need retractable gear. Just here and here. That looks about right, doesn't it? Maybe we can move that a little bit forward. Yeah, that looks fine. I'm sure it'll be fine. Alright, let's take this for a spin. Oh yeah, we can paint these as well. Let's paint it. So, uh, ooh, red and white, blue angels, desert. Oh, desert color looks nice. I like the monochrome too. It's very nice. Alright, we're going to go with the desert colors. Okay, so we've got these to do with the rolling, and these are the pitch, and we've got our rudder. So in theory, this should fly. Well, propellers are turning. We've got a little bit more torque than we need it to. Oh! What happened there? Alright, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's restart that. So, zoom out a little bit more. Let's see what happened there. Okay. I think I know what's going wrong. 
Okay, so really it, it comes down to the way that we've got these set up. We obviously need more power. I don't know which way the rotors at the top are turning. Those are turning to the left. I see. I'm starting to think that this actually might just be too heavy, and I think it's because we've got too much fuel here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop this down. So get rid of some of the fuel, and put that closer to the middle. Yeah, I'm actually thinking about this, actually trying to do this properly. So the fuel is now in the middle, and we have a lot less of it. Maybe we can take off now. Just as a quick test. Yep, yeah, we're definitely light enough to take off now. So there's that. It doesn't look as pretty as it used to, I've got to be honest. But sometimes beauty isn't everything. So we're going to start off with a nice 19% throttle here. Trying to counteract that, that rotation. It really doesn't want to work, does it? Alright, new plan. Well, this is one that I prepared earlier. This is actually a design that I've made before, and it's a little bit tricky to fly. So, this is a quad rotor, which, um, well, it does that. But the main idea is that it's supposed to be capable of vertical flight. Now, I think we can actually take off with a very, very small amount of power. That's just... I'm just testing a theory here. There we go. And there... It's down... And... Alright, after many, many attempts, I'm finally in the air, and honestly, it doesn't fly that badly. It's just a very tricky aircraft to take off with, but it's very, very good at uh, being controllable at very, very low speeds, mainly because you can just sort of pull the engines up like that. So, there is something to this. And that's one of the strengths of this this well this game actually is that you can just do things like that. You can build whatever the hell you want, really. <laughs> now I've noticed this a little bridge over there, and I feel like this is a challenge that we need to really try and take on. So of course, I think you can see where this is going. All right, coming back around. I'm upside down, that is not what I meant to do. Pulling it up, pulling it up, pulling it up, pulling it up. And under the bridge! And almost hitting the bridge. I wonder if we can go through it. We have run out of fuel though, that could be a problem. Well that's as soft a landing as I've ever seen one. Bye bye plane! Yes, I'm afraid that's all we have time for today. That's a, just a quick look at simple planes. We have a lot of aircraft that is actually included with this game. I mean, there's, there's this. There's a nice little stunt plane here as well. And the P-51 Mustang there. There's a lot of nice custom planes there. A very simple seaplane as well. And the twin prop, which we saw earlier, and of course, a bunch of others as well. And of course, there are downloadable planes on the workshop as well. Not the Steam Workshop, but the actual Simple Planes website. I think there might be Steam Workshop support. I'm not sure. But let me know if you like this the, this game. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. Do you want to see more Simple Planes? Or do you want to see uh, what other games have you guys got in mind that I should check out? Let me know down in the comments below. And if you have a type of plane you'd like to see me try and make, please let me know down in the comments below. And leave a like if you have enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. My name is Panzer, and I'll see you next time.